So here we have the W2S W001 uh, test board. It actually consists of the W2S W001 uh, Wi-Fi device, an SMA connector for an antenna, and this stub here is for connection to a laptop or through an SDIO interface. There, uh, uh, there's also an antenna supplied with the kit and a CD consisting of the Wi-Fi driver running on a Windows XP and a quick start guide. So the first step in getting the test board up and running, we take the antenna, we screw that into the SMA connector, and once we've done that, we plug in, we plug that into the SDIO slot of the laptop. Before you do that, you do need to ensure that the built-in Wi-Fi of the laptop has been disabled. In this case, there's a switch here to disable that. Once that's done, you plug in the test board into the SDIO slot. So once we plug the test card in there, we actually see a couple of windows pop up which indicate found new hardware. Uh, in addition, a window pops up saying insert disk. And on there, we click OK and actually go to the source where the driver is located and we install the driver. So once the dev kit uh, Wi-Fi driver has been installed, we can check and verify that it indeed is installed correctly. We go to device manager and we scroll down until we come down to network adapters. And if we look down there, it, it's acknowledged Marvel SD8686 wireless LAN SDIO adapter. So that indicates the driver has been installed correctly. Uh, next, we can check to see what networks are available. And if we just click here, we may we can check which one we're associated with if we go to view wireless networks and we see here it's dealing y to y connected the next step is now we can actually fire up a web browser and browse the internet so we'll we'll go to the y to y website And there we are. So here we have uh, using the W2SW0001 test board. Uh, we've, ins uh, we've inserted the test board in a laptop, installed a driver, and now we're able to browse the web and have Wi-Fi connectivity all in the space of about four minutes.